This is the EEG of a patient in N3 or slow wave sleep, the deepest stage of non-REM sleep, characterized by slow delta waves with frequencies between 1.5 and 2.5 hertz. N3 sleep represents a critical phase of restorative sleep. These features are considered to be normal, and here's why. N3, also known as slow wave sleep or deep sleep, is the stage of sleep where the brain produces the slowest and highest amplitude waves of the sleep cycle. Delta waves which define the stage are low frequency, one and a half to two and a half hertz, and high amplitude often exceeding 75 microvolts. These waves occupy a significant portion of the EEG background during the stage. Previously, this phase was divided into two separate stages, N3, where delta activity made up 20 to 50% of the recording, and N4, where delta activity surpassed 50%. However, modern sleep staging has combined these into a single stage, N3. N3 is not just a passive state, it plays an essential role in the body's restorative processes. According to research published in Nature Neuroscience, this stage is crucial for memory consolidation, especially declarative memory. It also supports physical restoration, such as tissue repair and growth, and boosts immune system function. The high amplitude of delta waves reflects a synchronized firing of cortical neurons, which is believed to promote these regenerative activities. On the EEG, N3 sleep is defined by the presence of slow delta waves that dominate the background. These waves are regular, high amplitude oscillations, signaling the brain's transition into a deeply restful state. This stage differs significantly from earlier sleep stages as the slower frequencies and higher voltages indicate reduced sensory responsiveness and deeper unconsciousness. Research from Journal of Sleep Research highlights that the presence of continuous delta waves is a hallmark of this stage and correlates with reduced metabolic activity in the brain. While N3 sleep is normal and essential, any disruptions to this stage can have significant implications. A lack of slow wave sleep is associated with conditions like insomnia, depression, and neurodegenerative diseases as noted in Sleep Medicine Review. Additionally, excessive delta activity outside of N3 sleep, particularly during wakefulness, may indicate encephalopathy or structural brain lesions, underscoring the importance of accurate sleep staging during EEG analysis. All right, let's recap. N3 or slow wave sleep is the deepest stage of non-REM sleep characterized by one and a half to two and a half hertz delta waves with amplitudes exceeding 75 microvolts. Unified classification. Previously divided into N3 and N4, now combined into a single stage representing all phases of slow wave sleep. Physical significance. N3 sleep supports memory consolidation, tissue repair, and immune function. EEG patterns. The EEG is dominated by high amplitude delta waves reflecting reduced sensory responsiveness and deep restorative processes. Clinical importance. Disruptions or deviations in delta activity can signal sleep disorders or neurological conditions. And that's it folks, I'll see you next Tuesday for another Two Minute Tuesday video.